Now, before we get started, I want to tell you in this video about the three stages to your Amazon business success. Now, you do need to think about your business in a long term fashion. And the core to this is actually behaving differently in each of these three phases. Phase one is all about the launch of your first product. It's all about getting your Amazon business started. Now, what you need to do in this phase is to develop a sales base, develop customers who are actually going to be buying your products. And from that, develop a very solid platform of reviews. And these two things are absolutely crucial. Amazon wants to see you regularly selling and getting positive, good five-star reviews for your products from those customers. Phase two is all about growth. And this is where you launch your second but complementary product. So it's in the same niche, it's in the same area, and it's the sort of product that's going to be used by the same customer base. Once you've got that second product in the FBA system, then you can cross sell and refer. And actually, Amazon will do it for you because it'll say customers who bought this also bought that. So they really help you to do that. And you therefore get a multiplier benefit. It's not one plus one equals two. It's one plus one equals three or four or five. In phase three, it's all about value. It's about getting more value from your individual customers. And you do this by creating more upsells, but actually engaging with them. You need to try to get hold of their email addresses. And if you're building uh, leads offline, you can do this very easily. Or you need to try to give them offers, perhaps which go into the packaging of your, of your actual product, where they're then tempted to come to your website, sign up in order to get a bonus or a discount on a future sale. Uh, you should at this stage also be selling through your own website and through other platforms, possibly even things like eBay, because you can always send them back into uh, FBA to get it from, F from, from Amazon at the end of the day. So you're still having all the, the, um, the, the handling done by Amazon, because at the end of the day, if they make a purchase from you, you can just simply give them a, a discount code that they then take into Amazon, press go and off they, off they are and they can, can buy the product. But it's really important to establish these relationships so you get this real growth of the value from your customers. But you only do this once your core Amazon FBA business is up and running. So those are the three distinct stages which you need to be thinking about before you start your Amazon business. I hope that was helpful. I look forward to seeing you very much in the next video.